So, hi guys, it's Cicely here, and today I'm going to be doing a Lush haul. So, let's get started. Do you know what that was? <laughs> right, so, the first thing I've got is this Granny Takes a Dip bath bomb. And this is really good for the skin. You just um, pop it in the bath. And it makes lots of different colours and different swirls and everything. And it's a really nice bath bomb. And I will show you pictures of the bath bombs as well. But love everything about it. it smells so good as well. And I would definitely rec rec recommend um, Granny Takes a Dip because it's always a nice one to have on them really nice days or a day a day when you're just feeling. <sighs> Or you just want to have a really nice bath and feel really happy. Just pop this in because I love that. Um, yeah, it's my favourite. Next one is um, the Car. Can't speak today. Karma, and this um, is apparently out of all of the lush um, bath bombs. No bubble bars this is the best one because it helps the skin a lot i've gone through two of these so far and basically break a bit off and put it in the bath or you can rub it all over your face and all over your body that's what i do because i think it gives me a really nice soft baby skin feel and i love it i'm not trying to be quick on this but I always, I just don't really want it to be a really long video, like always. Next one is, which one is this? Fluffy Egg. And this um, one is a bath bomb, I think, again. Yeah, bath bomb. And I absolutely love this. Like, it's the cutest thing ever. And... Um, um, I have had another, another bath bomb but I, I just couldn't I just couldn't leave it till this video I had to use it just had to it was called think pink it was the same as this but it was just a circle with flowers and I love the flowers in this one blue and pink this is a really nice one and again most of these things are all good for your skin because they're all really um, made with um, food products and things like that really good products for skin so that one's fluffy egg next one is I think this is called sky blue um, bubble bar but basically this um, I well like again I broke some off and I used some in the bath because I just I just can't I just because I didn't have enough time to film this the other day so I just had to have a bit <laughs> in the bath and this smells really nice again but if you go too close you might get some up your nose and that's not good <laughs> so yes a lovely one as well and um, this I've only been through one of these because most bubble bars bubble bars are my favourite thing to have and that one I um, haven't really tried before because I've always reached for the Karma or the um, Bright Side bubble bar. I've actually just finished the Bright Side so I can't really show you, show you that yet. Next one is a, a, a bubble bar slice. Pop in the bath. I don't know what this, this is called. But bubble bar slice. That's what it says on there. I really don't know what this one is called um, but basically again a lovely but this one is a really good like small one and because it's got like a big flower and it literally covers the whole of the bubble bar on the top you can like literally break some off and you've also got some of the flower not all of it but you've also got some of it so it's really nice and good and this feels like a bath belt because 
like when I feel it, it's just like so soft. And I was just like, how weird. Because all of my other bubble bars are never this soft. And this one is just so soft. And I love this, so soft. And again, really good for the skin. Lovely. The next one is actually one that um, I couldn't help, but that it's a big Easter egg, and you crack it, and there's either a chicken there or a bunny rabbit, and I got the bunny rabbit, and I'm actually going to use this tonight in my bath. This little cute bunny. I love this. It smells so good. I don't know why I'm whispering. It smells so good. Oh. So yeah, this one is called. Did I tell you what they were all called? Yeah, I think I did. This one is called. Sorry if I'm out of focus. Come in focus. Put in the comments down below if I've got any of these wrong because I'm just reading from the packet. Last but not least, this I have to say is probably my favourite. I have tried a pink one of these before, but I was just pulled to this green one. Like I couldn't help myself, but I was just pulled to it. Like, like it's like so good. And this is handmade with fresh ingredients. And looking at them lemon oil that's what I can smell then there's a really strong smell of like lemon and lime slash apple hope you enjoyed this video comment down below what video you want me to do next subscribe and give this video a massive big thumbs up and bye so I <laughs> So I hope you like my video. Comment down below. <laughs> oh my God, what is wrong? What's going on? <laughs> no.